Hi everyone, I'm Steve, here again with Nicole, the gut girl. Thanks for being with us, Nicole. Thanks for having me. You know, you brought up something we're going to talk about, condiments. This is really important for people to know, you know, and it's like, I didn't say this off camera, but when we, when my wife and I go to restaurants, we ask them, because a lot of restaurants, restaurants we go to, they make their own salad dressing. Mm -hmm. And the question for us is, do you make it with olive oil? If they yeah. say yes, they make it from scratch and they make it from olive oil, I'll order a salad. Right. But if not, that salad is not good for you. No, you've just completely taken all the goodness away. <laughs> right. So let's talk about condiments. And, you know, a place where people have condiments is on a hamburger Mm -hmm. with a bun and they put mayonnaise and ketchup and um i will leave um there is a link in the description to primal kitchen uh and I, if you use that link and you go to, and use promo code vitality one you'll get 10 percent off whatever you buy there that's where i buy condiments you can also get them in grocery stores like i know rayleigh's has them so um you can get the primal kitchen um products also in grocery stores a lot of grocery stores but you can also use the link and when you order it there you'll get 10 percent off the reason they're good is because they use avocado oil right yes absolutely and always no matter what you're you're looking at in a grocery store turn it over and check the ingredients if it, there's soybean oil vegetable oil any of that kind of stuff number one it's just crap don't have those kind of things. But one of the things that the reason why I brought this topic was because I'm having a lot of people come to me for their nutrition <laughs> and they don't think certain things are going to change or that I'm going to discuss with them to take out of their diets. And one of the things is condiments. They don't, you know, if you're doing a keto diet, they think, oh, I can have a ton of ketchup. It's a tomato. You actually can't unless you check what's in that ketchup. There is a ton of high fructose corn syrup. There's a ton of sugar. And I don't know, like when you're a condiment person, you have a lot. You're not just having one serving size, which is a tablespoon usually. Right. So it's such a good point, Nicole. If you're going to be a food Nazi like me, you know, I have my cheat meals once in a while. You know, I had a hamburger. I mean, it was healthy yesterday, went out with my son, but you can't just walk into the grocery store and buy ketchup. You can't just walk into the grocery store and buy mayonnaise without looking at it because you're buying garbage, right? Gar garbage. I, we went into this grocery store last night and I happened to um, run into one of my clients and she was in the condiment aisle and she was, was like she hiding her was she hiding her literally she's like don't look the card but i do want your suggestion on this and so she was looking at salad dressings and it was i said you know we usually get either primal kitchen or um or i make my own salad dressing because it's just crap there are upwards of 12 grams of sugar in a fat free salad dressing, which therein lies the problem. They have marketed that it's fat free and good for you and all the things, but you turn it over 12 grams of sugar. It's got a soybean oil in it. And so now where is any of the nutrients? It's null and void. The fructose, the corn syrup, mm -hmm. bad stuff. Bad. That really is bad. bad stuff. I mean, you're putting poison on your food. And then you're wondering, and here is a huge point to take home. You're wondering, man, I'm doing so good. I'm eating these fruits and vegetables and I'm doing so good. But you're ton putting a ton of condiments on that are derailing your entire process. When all it takes is to look at some labels. Yeah. Primal Kitchen, everyone out there, that's a good product. Now, you can also get it at Thrive Market. I like Thrive Market. I'm not affiliated with them, but you can also get the Primal Kitchen products there. If you don't want to use the link uh, that I leave there, 
um, in the description. You can just go to um, Thrive Market, which is an online grocery store, and yeah, they've got a lot of good products. They've got some bad ones, too. You still got to pay attention to what you're buying. There is nothing you know? out there that you can't do that you don't. If you're taking an interest in your health, look at all the labels. Yeah. All right, Nicole. Well, um, if now Nicole works with clients uh, as a nutritionist and um, tell us a little bit about your background. So, well, I got into this because I had a thyroid problem and I went to probably five different doctors and they told me I should exercise more. At Were they fat doctors? <laughs> um, yes, matter of fact. Um, so I what, hate that. I yeah. hate fat doctors telling you what to do. Well, I'm, I'm going to get trashed in the, I'm going to get trashed for <laughs> saying that. Well, they're smarter than you. They're hypocrites. Yeah. You know, when somebody tells me to exercise more and I teach five classes a week and I'm an exercise Nazi, I, that is not the solution for me. So I finally had a fill and I went back to school and got my master's degree in holistic nutrition. And I'm continuing my education now as well into further. So um, I just really, you know, everything is the crux of what you put in your mouth. It is the we have so depleted our soils, our food products are terrible. Um, and so I just was like, I'm not doing this anymore. I'm going to solve this for myself without needing a doctor. So that's when I went back to school. Yeah, that's great. So Nicole, um, if somebody wants to work with you or they want to find out more, you'll give them a hundred dollars off if they mention this interview. Absolutely. And you can reach me at the gut girl one at gmail.com. All right, I'll put that in the description. And uh, you guys reach out, tell, uh, tell her that you saw this and she'll give you a discount. Um, Nicole, thanks for being with us. Thank you for having me.